Okay, let's go. You ready? Fucking go. Fucking go. <laughs> nice to have you uh, on our show. It's a pleasure. You're quite famous. Shut up. Yeah, you I'm are. Not famous. Yeah, you say. are. So today, I didn't know, <laughs> but you also have a football team. You didn't know I had a football team? I didn't team. know. It's crazy. Do you like football? Not that much. I like playing football. Okay. But not that much uh, watching. I prefer action than uh, just see people doing stuff. Yeah, I have a football team. Real Bedford. Okay. How's it going? It's good. It's good? Yeah, yeah. It's What's really the thing with Bitcoin? There is no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're the Bitcoin team. We hold Bitcoin in our treasury. Okay. If you come to a game, you can buy everything with Bitcoin. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. Like the, the beer, the... The beer, the burgers... Oh, really? The merchandise, you can buy it with Bitcoin, yeah. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, very cool. Is it uh, a good way to, like, to spread Bitcoin words? I call oh. it a cheat code. <laughs> it's a cheat code for us. Yeah, look, we, you've seen, we've, got so, we've sold all our merch. Look at how much. These bags were full. We sell so much merch because Bitcoiners want to support a team. And so that's good for us. Okay, of course. Gives us, uh, means we have more money to spend on players. Okay. And I heard you that I heard from you that your show is one of the the biggest one. It's the biggest in the universe. In the universe. Yeah, in the whole universe. So the the objective for your team is also <laughs> to become the biggest. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Eventually, we will take our team. We'll get on the. Uh, we'll, we'll go into that tunnel. We'll come across to France and we'll start kicking French teams' asses too. See you there. <laughs> yeah. We'll come to Paris. We'll smash them. We'll go to Nice. We'll smash them. Yeah, Bitcoin can be can be good at it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like the honey badger team. <laughs> We are the honey badger team. Okay, so now I've got a question uh, okay. related to your show. Yes. So what what is your show first? Was how did you end up uh, doing this, and how the 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 idea of showing what Bitcoin did came up to you? Well, so uh, so I was buying drugs on the internet with Bitcoin. Okay, classic. Yeah, yeah classic. Uh, and then I started to learn about Bitcoin. I tried to trade it. I was rubbish at trading it. It was terrible. And, and then I met a guy who was doing a podcast. I was like, that's cool. I want to do a podcast. So I started a podcast and people seemed to like it and they listened to it. And then uh, six years later, I'm here talking to you. That's it. Okay. It that's was just six years ago. Seven years now, actually, was it? 2017? Where are we? 2024? Yeah, it'll be seven years in November. So six and a half years. Okay. It's gone so quick, man. I've and- got fat, old and gray. <laughs> Why you did are, you do you it? Athletic first. <laughs> I was. I was like you. I was like, hmm. nah, I wasn't. <laughs> I've always been a fatty. Okay. <laughs> and uh, do you do you still have the energy to continue? No. To, do, do you think it's the end of your show? Done. I'm so tired. Yeah, really? I'm so tired. Yeah. You could take over. What what what's what Bitcoin did in French? It's ugly. Je <laughs> Bitcoin. Qu'est-ce que Bitcoin a fait? Oh, it sounds so beautiful. Ah, you think? Qu'est-ce que Bitcoin a fait? <laughs> That's French language, isn't it? <laughs> like, with English, it's what Bitcoin did. It's like, it's normal. French is so, it's so romantic. Qu'est-ce que Bitcoin a fait? Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, but for French people, it's like, bro. But when it's German, it's like, uh... But if it's German, it's like, blah, 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 Bitcoin, blah. Sounds yeah. so lovely. Yeah, it's true. I like French hip-hop. You like? I like NTM. What do you listen? No, NTM, Netamer. Ah, NTM. Yeah, do you know Netamer? No. Does that mean fuck your mum or something? Netamer. Ah, uh, Nick Tamer. Yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. Does that mean I fuck your mama? Yeah, 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 I fuck your mother. Fuck your mother. But it's old. I like them. That was for my parents. Yeah, well, I'm <laughs> like your parents. How old are you? I'm 25. Yeah, I'm like 45. I could be your dad. Yeah, you could be. Yeah. A great dad. Yeah. <laughs> could be rich. <laughs> yeah. One day. Yeah, and um, so I've got the same question as you ask usually for your the people that come to your show. It's for my people. Yeah, for your people. What, what That's a Nick Tamer song, For My People. Yeah, it could be. Do you know that? No. They've got a song called For My People. Really? Yeah, it's a great song. Simple song. Okay. Sorry, anyway. All right, go on. And, uh, <laughs> it's hard to follow. <laughs> I know. Right. What is your question? <laughs> yeah, it's what Spin Bitcoin did to you. What Bitcoin did to me? Yeah. Oh, God. Bitcoin. What did Bitcoin do to me? So Bitcoin didn't do anything to me. Bitcoin enabled me to have a fork in my life. I was, my life was one way. I discovered Bitcoin and went another way. So it just enabled me to, in a word way. It, it, well, I, so I was working in advertising. I was, you know, that was my old life. I started a podcast now. I just travel the world. I meet cool people like you. I do interviews. I'm in a football stadium here in Madeira, beautiful Madeira. I've been to 40, 50 countries with this podcast. 
I've interviewed presidents and leaders and smart people. It's just uh, it's the most incredible life. I feel so blessed. Okay. I've just been very lucky. You, you were first in, uh, in the media industry? In advertising. Uh, advertising. Yeah, I had an advertising agency. Okay. Blood-sucking <laughs> vampires convincing you to buy shit you don't need. Okay. And did you think that Bitcoin changed the way you, you interact with people and you're doing business? No, I think a little bit. I think doing a podcast made... Okay. You learn, you know, you're an interviewer, you learn how to speak to people, how to respond to their, you know, reactions, behaviors. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Um, yeah it's weird. <laughs> Especially with you. I know, I'm fucking, I'm annoying. <laughs> I like that guy's sweater. Uh, I like your sweater. I like that. Look, come here, let me come in. I like that sweater. Where's that from? I like that a lot. Auburn, I'm going to look that up. Do you want to sell it to me? No, I'd be too, I'm too big for that. I'm going to have to get one. That's a cool sweater. Anyway, enjoy it. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry about that. <laughs> it's a cool sweater, isn't it? Yeah, it's, that's my favorite, isn't it? <laughs> well, I'm old. So I wear old people clothes. Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got another one. What for you is the most interesting property of Bitcoin? Uh, it gets you rich. Gets you rich. Yeah. Number goes up. Number goes up. Yeah. That's the, no. <laughs> the most interesting probably of Bitcoin, I think, is uh, I'm here selling merch, right? If I try and use cards, um, I have to uh, uh, log into a system and put in their card and hope it transacts and wait for the money to come back. And if I take cash, I've got to have the correct change. With Bitcoin, I literally just punch in a number. Done. Blood. Like, it's instant. It's generally the easiest and best form of money to transact with. Okay. I mean, it's, there's so many good things about Bitcoin. Like, it's a hard... Yeah. But this is the one that... Uh, this is the one that came to mind right now here when I'm selling shit. <laughs> yeah. And um, you... I've seen your documentary recently about Lebanon. Yeah. It was a really great one. Mate. I've got so many things. And um, for, for you, like, what was the... Can, can you explain first what happened there? What was the, the issue? Because there was the accident with... The, well, the, yeah, so you had it's the port the corona, explosion. The, the corruption, everything. I mean, they just got hit with everything. Port explosion, uh, uh, hyperinflation, and then the government stole all their money. I mean, the people at Lebanon just got shit on over and over and over. Just bosh, bosh, bosh. And there's effect no effective government there anymore. There's no real government. And people are rebuilding the country on their own. It's the most beautiful thing to see. Uh, it blew my mind. I just, you should go. I think everyone should go to Lebanon. It's an incredible country, incredible, beautiful people. But they should go or search just to, to see how it Do you want to No, go and have a holiday. Okay. It's for only for, okay. Yeah, there's no effective government and everything is kind of rebuilding, getting back together. Okay. There is absolutely no government right now. Just some like kind of fringe uh, government. Old mafia. Uh, no, fringe. Yeah, well, they, they, I mean, the government is mafia, but it's like fringe government doing like small things like uh, borders and passports, but everything else has collapsed. Okay. And are they like rebuilding a government right now? No. No, no, they're trying to live as, no, government, as they can. Government's in deadlock, and it's just a bunch of people left stealing shit. Okay, yeah. So there is no leader right nope. now. Just uh, I mean, there is, but entrepreneur th trying to to bring value to other no, people. No, there is. They, I mean, they have a president, um, but there's no effective government. They're not really doing anything. They're just stealing stuff. Okay. And did you follow the the the, the initiative that was going on with the the people trying to bring light? On the street, is it that was in my, that was in my film? Yeah, we yeah. raised the money through Bitcoin to get one street yeah. lit. It's incredible. How much did you raise? Rebirth for? Beirut. I mean, it was like two and a half thousand dollars in a couple of days. But that that paid for one street to be relit. They're called Rebirth Beirut. Check out Rebirth Beirut. Okay. Yeah. Do you have any other ID? You don't listen anything. <laughs> you don't listen. All right. Well, listen. Thank you, man. Yeah, I Appreciate you. you. All right. Thank you. Sorry for being a weirdo. No, it's okay. Yeah. We we need some. Uh, Extravagant. <laughs>